So Nikolai Blinov has given the full double up to Big Roger, and now the 20K top up. He's uh, so now he's fully vested. Blinov down fifteen thousand dollars now. Big Raj ahead 12K. He was the big loser for a while. Daniel Kate's the big winner at this table. But uh, the real story, of course, in the stacks. Over $200,000 on this table right now. Pretty much the biggest opener. Everyone else is really opening to five or six. Kate's opening to at least seven. Three and a half times the big blind. Just, that's just a cash game thing, isn't it? Yeah. Dominate. And as he's from the he's from the straddle position, this is kind of not what you'd hope when you're in the straddle with two kings that you just have the one razor. And jungle's peeled off with the suited ace. Check. Check. Uh, what's Dominic's idea here? He, is it, it feel like there's not very many hands he can Check. get value from that he beats? Or yeah, he's checking for pop control too. Cause you, if you bet leave the fop and you get raised, you just you're miserable. Check. Dominic's checked three times. Ten thousand best. Oh my god. And he's bet he's bet double pot. He's bet double pot. I mean, what a bet. Surely it could be like I guess a jack, but I mean given the action, isn't it like Every single, he could have he could have anything that he would have peeled off the flop with before the flop because there's been no action since before the flop. I mean, don't you just have to call? You oh, just he have called. To, you have to call, Can don't you? Yeah. Whoa. Oh, really? Yep. You think it was a really good call? I think it was a world class call. So and Nietzsche has owned the jungle. You know, I think it's a world class bet too. I mean, maybe ten thousand a little too greedy. He could have got the same. <laughs> if he's gonna call seven, he's gonna call ten. So I think like six or seven was just as effective. Mm -hmm. 